Hi everyone, happy day 148. This morning, after I dropped my boys off at school, I headed over to church to say the rosary at 8.30, followed by mass at 9. For the next few days, I'm going to have to be flexible with my plan. One of my best friends and her family have come to visit us for the next three days. Tomorrow and Wednesday, she will be going to work with my husband to try to learn the business, so that will leave me on kid duty. I am going to try to bring them to church with me, but we will see how that goes. If it doesn't work, I always know I have a backup plan. Today being Monday, it's time to take out our weekly evaluations and ask ourselves the four questions. One, did my plan work for me? Two, what needs to be adjusted? Three, how do I feel? And four, what is a positive from the week? For me, one, yes, my plan worked for me. Two, this week I will have to adjust the next couple of days and be flexible. Three, I feel really good. And four, a positive from the week would have to be the lesson I learned last Friday. This way of life takes a lot of hard work and sometimes I just fall short, but that's okay, even for me. I would encourage all of you out there to take a look at last week and ask yourselves the four questions. Today I wanna to talk to you about where I'm at in this journey. I woke up this morning feeling unsettled, almost a queasy stomach. Not because I have a virus, but because I have a control problem. I knew that my friend was coming, so I have spent the last couple of days getting everything ready. I'm not sure about you, but I can get really crazy over trying to make everything perfect. Let's just say my husband caught me vacuuming the garage on Saturday. Every time I feel myself getting like this, I want to stop, but I don't. Instead, I make myself crazy. So today, day 148, I have decided I'm done. I'm done living with one foot towards the world and one foot towards God. Being a Monican mom isn't just a group I started or a thing I'm doing. It's a way of life for me. I need to eliminate anything that gets in the way of that. I am either dead to this world or I'm not. I cannot do both anymore. Today I brought all the stuff that is holding me back from completely giving up everything to God and I imagined it all laying there at the altar. I gave Jesus my control, my obsessions, my craziness, and every empty promise this world has to offer me and I laid it at his feet. Once I did that, a peace came over me like I have never felt before. I feel like I have been set free from this world in the chains I have bound myself with for all these years. Sometimes I just need to be put in enough pain to change, and day 148, I was done. What day will you be done? I hope all of you out there have a blessed day 148. Please know that I am praying for you always, and I will see you tomorrow.